In today's video, we're going to take a look at accessing manual journals in Xero. We're going to show you how to do that if you're an advisor and also if you watch carefully I'll show you the sneaky way to get there even if you don't have advisor status in Xero. If you like the video please let me know that you like it. Why don't you subscribe to the channel? It really helps me to continue uploading these videos on a regular basis. So let's head into Xero and I'll show you how to access manual journals. Okay, let me show you how to access manual journals in Xero. First of all, let's take a look at the user settings. So if we go to the name at the top left, choose settings, go to users, find my name, and I can see when we scroll down, when we get to the business and accounting section that I am set up as an advisor. So what that means is when we go back to the dashboard, if I choose accounting, if I choose advanced, I then have an option over in the left here to choose manual journals. If I use manual journals regularly, I probably give them a blue star. That would then mean back in the dashboard, now when I go to accounting, if I scroll down to the advanced section, manual journals is here. And then I can enter a new journal. But what happens if I am not set up as an advisor, but I still need to access journals? Well, there is a sneaky way and I'm going to show you how to get there. So we'll go back to users. And this time, when I scroll down to the business and accounting, I'm going to say I'm no longer an advisor. I only have standard access. But I also need to make sure that this option is ticked. Reports, I need to be able to view and rerun the reports and then update permissions. We'll head back to the dashboard. Always a good place to go to. This time, accounting, advanced, and look what happens over at the left hand side. I no longer have that manual journal option, but this is where I'm going to show you what to do. So we go to accounting and instead of advanced, we go to reports and we need to access a journal entry report. Now, if we scroll down, I know, or at least I should know if I scroll down to taxes and balances, the report that I want is here. It's called journal report. But if I didn't know where to find it, I would just go to the search, start typing in the word journal, and here's the report that I need. Now I'm on the journal report, and if you look carefully, I have this option to add a new journal. When I select that, I'm in exactly the same place as before if I had been an advisor and I had gone through the advanced. So that is how you access manual journals, easy if you're an advisor, but still doable if you're not, as long as you have access to reports in Xero. I hope you find that useful. If you need help with Xero, remember that I do offer a bespoke training. You can always get in touch with me. It's marian at xuacademy.com. But until next time, happy Xeroing.